Madison Junior High. Hello, this is Mr. Stuckey with the Student Council. We've got some exciting things coming up this month, October. Um, I just want to give a, a brief update on the things that we have planned and what you can do to get involved. Uh, number one, we will have a Halloween assembly on the 31st. Uh, the time is to be determined still, but please be ready for that. It's going to be a lot of fun. Uh, come prepared to have a blast. Um, we will have a costume contest during that assembly. Now, in years past, we have just showed up to the assembly and picked random people from the crowd for the costume contest. We're trying to change that this year uh, to be a little bit more fair. So what we're going to do is, on the rundown, there will be two links that you can follow as a student. One of them is for the single costume entry, and one of them is for the group costume entry. By following those links, you can fill out the form to submit yourself as a contestant for the costume contest. Over the course of the month, the student council will review submissions, and at the end of the month, before the assembly, we will choose 10 people for the single costume contest and 10 groups for the group costume contest. Those 10 people will be notified that they've been selected to compete where then in the assembly we will call down those 10 people and we will have the student body vote for best contest. There will be a winner for single, a winner for costume, and we're also going to have a teacher contest as well for the different departments. So please read the instructions on the form for how to submit and what the criteria is. Okay, you gotta make sure you follow dress code. Can't have things like masks or face paint and the costumes obviously need to be appropriate. Group costumes can be anywhere from two to 10 individuals. Um, and like I said, we'll sort through them throughout the month. So go ahead, follow those directions. We're looking forward to it. We've got some dodgeball competitions uh, later this month. So uh, stay tuned for updates on that. We're looking forward to a fun October. Hello Bobcats, welcome to the second day of Start With Hello Week. Today's focus, say hello to a new friend. Let's start today off with a joke. How did the barber win the race? He knew a shortcut. Here's your daily rundown. <laughs> Boys Varsity Soccer has a game at 4.30 p.m. against Canyon Ridge. Girls JV Volleyball has an away game at 5.30 at Rigby. Girls Varsity Soccer is playing at home at 7 against Canyon Ridge. Girls Freshman Volleyball is away at Rigby for a game at 5.30. Girls Varsity Volleyball is playing at Rigby High School at 7. Now let's see another Mental Health Minute from Mrs. Chase. Hi Bobcats, it's Mrs. Chase with this week's Mental Health Minute. This week is Start With Hello Week, and I want to talk about inclusiveness. Inclusiveness is all about making sure everyone feels welcome and accepted. So we can start with a hello because it's such an easy way to create a connection. That simple act can help someone feel less lonely and more included. Being kind and inclusive to others boosts our confidence. And when we feel accepted by others, it also boosts our confidence. So it's a win-win both ways. When you start with hello, you are encouraging others, which helps them and you. Inclusiveness also opens up conversations. When we feel safe, we're more likely to share our feelings. So let's start with hello to create a space where everyone can feel safe to share their unique experiences, feelings, and perspectives. By including others, we can feel safe and share together. So what can you do? Start small. Start with hello. Invite someone new into your circle. Reach out to a classmate who might seem left out. Or simply put away your phone in the halls and say hi to those around you. You've got this. Stop by the counseling office if we can help. Together, we can make our school a place where everyone feels they belong. And that's this week's Mental Health Minute brought to you by the counseling office. Thanks, Mrs. Chase. A reminder that parent-teacher conferences are Wednesday and Thursday from 4 to 7 p.m. after school. Friday is the teacher in-service day, so all students have the day off. On that note, have a fantabulous day, Bobcats. Now please rise, remove any hats, and join us in reciting the Pledge of Allegiance. I, I pledge, pledge allegiance, allegiance to the flag.